like Boris, one of the very few of his kind in the country. Boris is a Sumatran marine toad. He looks pretty big and he's actually still growing. It's thought that he could soon reach the size of a rugby ball. So we took on Boris to add diversity to the animal unit. Um, he's quite an unusual um, animal, so we were really interested in him. And it gives the students um, a different species to work with on the animal unit here. Although he looks easy to handle, care must be taken at all times to avoid touching his poisonous glands. When handling Boris, you have to wear um, gloves and make sure you don't touch your face at all um, because he can cause um, hallucinations if you were to ingest any of his toxins. Um, however, saying that he's really friendly, um, so he doesn't secrete the toxins, um, which, could, which could harm us. So on Boris's um, shoulders here, you can see the glands which produce the toxin, which is a bufotoxin. And this is what secretes the poison, which is his defence mechanism against predation. When he secretes it, it's a milky white substance which comes out the glands behind his shoulders. Um, and this is the um, toxin which you would need to be careful of. And um, it's why you need to wear gloves. He's now part of the large animal family at Breckenhurst campus. And his new owners feel very lucky to have him as he's usually quite an odd one to find. Boris is really rare in this country, his breed. Um, we're really, really lucky to ha have him here on the animal unit. Um, he's not something you would see in every zoo around the country at all, so he's quite a rare species in this country. This new addition means that students can continue to learn about the weird and wonderful creatures around us. I'm Melanie Carbayo for Knots Tonight.